An international aid agency has suspended its work in detention centers in the Libyan city of Misrata because prisoners are being tortured and denied medical care. Medicine Sans Frontieres, also known as Doctors Without Borders, treated 115 people who suffered injuries after being interrogated. We're talking about 1,500 people who are held in these two detention centers today. And basically, uh, after a, a very serious series of incidents that took place early January, where we received 14 patients who had been uh, obviously tortured uh, during, their in, uh, uh, during their interrogation in the interrogation center, some of them couldn't walk. We had a patient with renal failure which, due to crush syndrome, which you can get after severe beatings. We've also had cases of uh, tissue necrosis due to uh, electroshocks and cigarette burns and a lot of marks around the feet, for example. So around the feet are so very clear examples of, uh, of ill treatment. The United Nations also expressed concern about people being mistreated in secret detention centers. The majority of detainees are accused of being Gaddafi loyalists and include a large number of sub-Saharan African nationals. The lack of oversight by the central authorities creates an environment conducive to torture and ill treatment. My staff have received alarming reports that this is happening in places of detention that they have visited.